what's good y'all welcome back to my channel my name is Sydney Brooks if you're new to it, my channel thank you for joining if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back before we get into this video make sure you are subscribed to my channel and turn your post bell notifications on so you can see when I post how rude <laughs> so you can see when I post my next video and if you want to follow me on social media, definitely go follow me, Sydney Grace Brooks on Instagram, Sydney Grace Brooks on TikTok. On TikTok, I'm on the road to 200K. Hope to meet it by the end of the year. So if you have any love in your heart, go <laughs> follow me on TikTok. I would sincerely appreciate it. In today's video, I'm going to be showing off some new pieces that I got for work. So this is going to be kind of like a work clothes haul basically i got a few pieces that i want to show y'all um but first off i do want to thank new york company for sending me most of these pieces i have two things that are not from them they're from tj maxx but everything else i will have linked in the bio below and i will have my discount code also in the description below so this is the box full of all of my clothes like i said i have a few things in here and they're all really cute i have one dress that i'm like i don't know if it's really cute but we're gonna see if i can make it work i'm gonna show y'all and have y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments below but let's go ahead and get started okay y'all this is the first outfit and before i get into it i do want to explain if you are new here i am a news anchor so i do have to make sure the way i dress is appropriate for tv with that being said i'll get into how i would make this more tv appropriate um some of y'all probably work in a workplace that would allow like your shorts to be out for me i would say you probably do want to cover up just a little bit more have sleeves have a blazer on something um, else to cover up your sleeves or cover up your shoulders i mean but if you work in an area i know a lot of like jobs these days are are way more chill than they used to be um so if you work in a corporate office that allows this then by all means go ahead but let's go ahead and get into it so both of these pieces are from new york and company i absolutely love these pants ladies if you are a part of the tall girl community these are so perfect for you i am around five seven five seven and a half five eight i don't know anymore haven't been checked haven't been told my height since i was in high school but i'm around that height and these pants go all the way down and they still have like a little scrunch at the bottom so if i wanted i could wear heels with them and they would still be perfectly fine they come all the way to the my ankles and they become skinny so they're kind of like skinny um slacks i would say um and then on the top they're a little bit high waisted but they fit perfectly around the waist like i said in the comments i will have the size and also the price so you can check them out now there is a blazer on new york and company that i'm pretty sure goes with this um, you just have to go find it on your own. It may be sold out, may not be. But I love this royal blue color. It is beautiful and it pairs with a lot of things. Black tops, white tops, whatever. Now, going into the top. This one is, I feel like these style tops are really popular right now. They're more of like a tank top. Um, is this considered razor back? No, I don't think so. Um, but it's like a silk, slick, silky kind of. It feels really good. It's soft, like it's really soft. But... Kind of like a silky material but they also come in cloth i know a lot of other brands like sell these these are great because they work really well one as an undershirt if i wanted to wear this with something else like a jacket over it i could completely do that or if you work in a workplace that says this is appropriate you could absolutely do that um but it's so comfortable it's a bodysuit basically so you can button button it down there <laughs> and then it pairs perfectly with any pair of slacks um this is what it looks like from the back if you see my straps i'm so sorry i'm trying to hide them um and these are the pants like i said both of them fit perfectly um new york and companies sizing can be a little bit weird you have to check their medium because their medium usually for me their medium is bigger than an actual medium compared to like other stores so whereas like a four and a six would be a medium sometimes for them it's higher than that like the size is higher than that so sometimes if you are a medium and a top somewhere else it may be a little bit bigger for new york and company so i would just make sure you check that out but this is a great thing you can go find like a white version a gray version or even switch out the color of the pants and this is a really easy outfit to do in the morning okay so i did mention that i would have to probably wear something over this so how I'm going to make this appropriate is I'm going to actually add a blazer to it. So this blazer is from TJ Maxx. Girl, it was $34. These, this, these are the items that I won't be able to put in the description below, obviously. But I went there and I found... It's funny because I saw a lot of things that I've seen in the mall 
that were around fifty to sixty dollars, and I saw the exact things in TJ Maxx, which is why I love TJ Maxx. But to make this appropriate for my job, I would basically put this jacket over it. This is just a plain jacket that matches the top, and obviously you can see now it's appropriate. I love this one because it scrunches up at the um, right here at the elbow. Obviously you can unbutton it and put it down. Yeah, you can unbutton it and pull the sleeves down. I have an issue sometimes. I have long arms with the with the sleeves not being long. So I usually go for the ones that have scrunched up sleeves. It just works for me. Um, but this is really cute. Um, it doesn't appear too big. It still comes in a little bit. Like when my arms are down, the blazer comes in a little bit right here. Nothing's too small. Nothing's too tight. And it fits perfectly. And I love this. You can wear this with dresses. You can wear this with other pants. It doesn't have to be this shirt. These pants are to be exact. You can switch it out with other things. All right, I can't lie. I was so excited to show you all this. This is so cute to me. I've never been the type of girl that loves wearing pink, like pink, pink, everything pink. I've never been like that. But I will say, I think when the springtime came around this year, I started getting more into wearing pink. And this dress, I am obsessed with. First of all, if you cannot tell, it's fitting me very well. Very, 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 very well. I want to say this is a medium. Like I said, I'll have every... By the way, my apartment is so noisy, so y'all might hear stuff. Y'all will definitely hear cars outside, and I apologize for that. But anyways, this fits me so well. I think this is a medium. It comes down... Now, I will say, be careful, because if you're taller than me, it might be too short on you. Um, I wish it was a little bit longer on me, but it's just going to have to work. If you're shorter than me, this will fit perfectly on you. But... It cinches in my waist, it has like this stitching right here, so it comes in smaller on the waist. And then the sleeve details are these really cute, adorable, they're like princess-like puff sleeves. And they are super cute. And let me say this, this dress is so comfortable, like it's really, really comfortable, it's adorable, it's in this pink color, and I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. This was for sure the, probably the best thing that I received in this package. I just love it. I think I'm just like completely obsessed with it. <sighs> I just want to take pictures of this. I, I don't even know if I want to just wear it to work. I think I just want to take pictures of it and call it a day, like have it on Instagram for the rest of my life. This is so cute. So cute. And it's also appropriate. That's what I love about New York companies that they have so many appropriate dresses on there that are great for work. You can absolutely wear this to work. You can wear the seat. What, Easter Sunday? I don't know. Something, something that's nice. Oh, this would be a really good wedding dress if you have a wedding to attend. I just love stuff like this. It's really cute, really girly. Um, and yeah, it fits perfectly. Okay, now for the third outfit, we have a mint green top. This sweater is from New York and Company. And then I paired them with these cream color pants that I already have, and these are from H&M. I will try my best to find them online if they are still available. But these are also really great. Still tall girl friendly. They go all the way down. However, they are different from the royal blue pants because these are basically straight leg pants. If not straight leg, then a little, a little bit of a flare. But I would say they go straight down, um, and these are more, they're a little bit thinner than these slacks that I had on. Um, but they are super cute, I think it goes perfectly with this green top. Now you can wear this with white jewelry, uh, silver, maybe gold jewelry, or even silver. You could really wear this with anything. This is great about these outfits that they pair with a lot of great things. But I think this is so cute. Again, we have these little puff sleeves. I don't know what the actual name of them are called, but they're these little puff sleeves. And then it comes down and it has the bottom of the shirt has this, or sweater I would say, has this part that kind of gets tighter. So it once again, it cinches in your waist. Now this is perfect, to, perfectly paired with, I would say, high-waisted pants. These pants are very, very high-waisted. <laughs> Now, if you were to wear these with low-rise pants, your stomach might show a little bit. I want to say this is a crop top, but without high-waisted high, right, high pants, it might show a little bit. Um, but I would just suggest wearing going ahead and wearing high-waisted pants. For me, this would be perfect for anchoring. I wouldn't have to change anything. I wouldn't have to wear a jacket because I already have sleeves. And these pants are super comfortable as well, so that is a big plus. All right, we've had a few good outfits. I think the last three were bangers. But it has, there has to be a time in our life that we run into 
a roadblock, okay? And this dress is the roadblock. I wanted this dress to work so bad. I'm gonna show y'all. I'm not even gonna try to fix it. Like I was probably, I was gonna hold it, you know, to try to make it, ow, it's pulling my hair. See, like this not meant for me, but I was gonna hold it and you know, make it look smaller so it would work for y'all. But I'm not even gonna do that. I'm gonna show y'all the real dress. This was giving like, Hillary. It's giving Hillary from Fresh Prince. It was supposed to, but it's when I put it on, it did not work. I think it's gonna work. For, I would think it would work for a lot of you other girls. Um, just not for me. It's not my day, Lord. It's not my day. But it. Eh, I just wanted to like it so bad, and it, I just don't think it fits me. First of all, it's like when I stand like this, like you can see, like it just doesn't fit me well. Like y'all saw how that pink dress fit me. It, this is not giving what it's supposed to give. And I honestly think I've done this before. I think this is a medium. It may be a medium, maybe not. I'm not to check, but this should be a medium from New York and Company. And I will say, like last time I got their shipment, their mediums were bigger. And I feel like this is the issue that I'm having. So I maybe, maybe if it was smaller, it will work. Let me know in the comments what y'all think about this. But I know how to shrink it, so I will be doing that. It will be taking a trip to the dryer very soon here. But for now, let me just show y'all. Okay, this would this is what it would look like if it was like more fitted. Like, like is that cuter or is it still ugly? <laughs> I don't know. But this one is like a little black and white. It's giving black. Uh, what is it? What are they called? Black and white gala type things. Black tie gala. It's giving those vibes. Well, it was supposed to at least. It has these little details. It has like these mock. Actually, these are real pockets. These are real. I put my phone in here. But this, this is not real. It has little mock mock pockets. Four of them. It has a little, a little stripe going down, and it's a. It has silver buttons as well with little crowns or whatever on them. The one thing I do say I do not like. I don't, I don't like when the buttons are like they feel like they can come off basically like they're not actually they're not actually like sewn tight to the fabric but they're kind of like dangling off these this is what these feel like and i feel like once whenever this happens whenever you have a dress like this or details like this if the thread gets caught in the washing machine or with some other clothes that button's gonna come off and i'm gonna seamstress so <laughs> hoping that never happens to me but yeah, like I said, this is the dress. I want to hear what y'all think about it. Maybe it's not that bad. Let me look in the mirror again. No, it's bad. It's really bad. <laughs> okay, so here is the second to last outfit. The last two outfits, I will be wearing these pants that I showed you earlier. They are from H&M. Um, they have those cream color pants. They just go well with the last two outfits, so I decided to put them together. Now, with this one, I will say it's not my favorite as well. Just like the last one, it's not my favorite. To me, it's giving welcome on board to Delta Airlines. The seatbelt sign is now on. I'll be coming around with the freshmen, and then I'll pick up the trash afterwards. Like, it's giving welcome on board. <laughs> it's giving straight flight attendant. And, I mean... I have a, okay, I do have like three shirts that have this little tie and in a lot of ways and sometimes it is pretty cute I may have to see if I can switch up this collar because it is feeling like it's too tight like maybe I can fold this down and then tie it somehow like that but this is how the girl had it the model had it on on the website so I did what she said and it's okay whenever I anchor I try to wear like if I'm wearing pants I try to wear a really nice shirt or something that has like good details something that really stands out because a lot I most of the time I'm standing behind the desk and so they can't see my pants so they're gonna see my shirt so if I'm not wearing a cute dress I want to wear like a, a shirt that has a lot of pizzazz to it basically so I would probably rate this one maybe like a six out of ten like I said it's not my favorite however it is still cute these sleeves don't come all the way down they have these little scrunchy parts at the very end so really they could come like right here um, but after, talk, after talking for a while, they kind of rise up. But this is the top. Like I said, this top is from New York and Company. The pants are from H&M. Like, okay, actually, I, so I, I, folded, I folded the neck down. When you do that, then it's not that bad. Actually, let's see. Let's see what it would look like with it unbuttoned. 
because it was choking me out a little bit. See, that isn't, I don't, I don't think that's how she's supposed to go. Or maybe, you know, I know the girlies be wearing their shirts like this sometimes, like to. I want you to know when I go to sleep at night, that's what I hear every day. Yes, it is just as loud as y'all. Just as loud as y'all are hearing it, that's how I hear it laying in bed. Mm hmm. <laughs> I mean, maybe. I don't think so. It just looks like it's not supposed to go that way. But I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to make this work. <laughs> we're, we're just going to move on. Let's move on, okay? All right, for the very last outfit, this is this pink blazer. This is really the style of the show. This is what I'm trying to show y'all. I've already showed y'all these cream colored pants. This is just a plain white like tank top com similar to the black one I showed you at the very beginning of this video. But the pink blazer is really what I want to show y'all. It is so cute. This is so easy. I mean you can wear this with any other outfit. You can wear this with a dress. You can wear this with shorts. You can wear this with a skirt. You can wear this with jeans. If you work as like if you're a teacher and you can dress a little bit more casual, you could definitely wear this. It is so perfect. It's also from TJ Maxx, very similar to the first blazer, except it doesn't scrunch up. It comes down. Like I told y'all, it's never long enough for my arms, but it still comes down to a really good length. It's cuffed at the bottom. It has this really good feeling. It looks, it looks like it cost more than it did. Um, and it has these brown turquoise buttons. But it is so cute and it fits really well as well. I've tried on a lot of blazers that fit like they were oversized basically, but I don't really like that style. I prefer these slim fit ones that kind of look like, appear like they come in a little bit towards your waist and your torso. Um, so I really like this. This is the final piece of the haul. All right, everyone, that is the end of this video. I really, really hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching this. I hope you were able to find some inspiration for your outfits or maybe you'll go pick up these pieces that I have um, left in the description below or try it on today. Um, whether you're in an internship, you're in school, you have an interview to go to this week, um, you work for yourself, you're an entrepreneur, doesn't matter what you're doing with your life. I feel like these pieces are very fitting for everybody. Um, if you do decide to pick up these or purchase these pieces, definitely let me know in the comments below. I would love to see your pictures in them. But like I said, I really enjoyed filming this video and I hope you guys did too. If you made it to the end of this video, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for spending the time, taking the time out of your day to watch my content. Like I said earlier, make sure you are subscribed, turn your post notifications on, and follow me on all of my social media accounts. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.